Hey guys, it's iPod Touch Girl 22 with a review of the Helix. Um, it's like the game controller I just reviewed not long ago. Actually, two videos ago or one video, two videos ago. And but this one is a little more advanced and nicer. Um, actually, Soldier no knows best reviewed this on his channel also, and um, it actually goes portrait and landscape. Works for iPod Touch and iPhone and it has a soft grip so that's one other good thing the other one was hard it also has a game c included in it twisted abyss which is $9.99 in the app store but i get the code for it for free so i'll review that later on if i like it and there's just a picture of it so it looks pretty interesting and fun anyway so earlier oh, actually i just opened this a while ago and um, I figured out on the back of this um, makeshift iPod is the code. So, I'm not going to show that. So I had to redo the video because I actually showed the code because I didn't know it was there. Anyways, so a quick look at it. Um, like I said, it works for iPod and iPhone. And uh, the people that sent me out this, is their website is called Posimotion, Posimotion something like that. Uh, link to their website will be down below. They have a ton of cool stuff on their website and you can get the Helix um, for $19.99, $20. And like I said, it works for portrait and landscape and it also, here's like a lot of cool instruction type things it does and the, some of the featured games that it works best with. So, Fast, Nova, Asphalt 5, Labyrinth 2, and Gangstar. And let's see. First, clip the I the adapter to the front of the helix, and then attach the iPod. So you can um, there's an adapter that comes with it for the iPod Touch. I don't think they, it was in there. Oh well, let's see if it works. Okay, so it fits my iPod perfectly fine. Uh, one thing also b better on this one than the other one, it has uh, an opening for the sync cable. The other one did too, but it did not have an opening for the volumes and the lock unlock key, but this one does. It also feels um, pretty nice in the hands, and let's go ahead and take a look. So, I guess it does. How do you twist it? That's the question. Um, you're also supposed to be able to twist it to where it goes to landscape so I'm going to try to do that oh wait I see what it is the adapter iPod adapter is already in it I guess I'll go ahead and take out the iPod real quick and the adapter Anyway, so somehow you're supposed to make it go to landscape. I mean, portrait mode. I'm sorry, I. Hmm. Oh well. So I'll just figure it out later on. And in maybe some of my other videos, I'll actually use this in like app reviews. So that's about it. Thanks for watching and thanks for Posy Posy Motion for sending this out for me to review. And yeah, so that's about it. How do you get this thing out? Oh well, I probably won't ever go landscape, I mean portrait mode anyways. So it looks really nice and I'm probably going to keep this one instead of the other one. The other one will actually go to my sister, not for giveaway. But so yeah, so that's about it. It's really comfortable in the hands. Woo. Yeah, and it's even comfortable just holding it like this, so you don't even need to change it back to landscape to portrait anyways, because it's just pretty much as comfortable, even though that might look weird. Anyway, so thanks for watching. I hope you liked this video, and remember, subscribe, comment what you thought of this um, thing, and favorite, thumbs up. 
Oh well, so just thanks for watching. Remember, subscribe. Yeah, I already said that. Uh, peace out. I'll see you guys later. Bye.